Hi, myself Dr. Jaya Prakash Shetty. I am a prosthodontist and dissident implantologist. Currently practicing at Chandra Layout. The clinic name is Asanamba Dental Care. And also I am working as a professor and head of the department of prosthodontics. And the university name is Rajiv Gandhi University of Health Sciences. Endodontically TT tooth generally becomes non-vital because of the removal of the vital tissues from the root of the tooth. So not only to become the non-vital, they become more brittle in order to get fractured. In order to avoid the fracture of the tooth, endodontically treated tooth generally restored with the crowns. Even though the crown or artificial crown or a cap, the fracture along with the root of the tooth, we can definitely restored with proper diagnosis. Depending upon the proper x-ray, depending upon the area of the fracture, depending upon the length of the fracture, depending upon the sizes of the fracture, we can give the proper restoration to the fracture tooth which is endodontically treated. If the root of the tooth is vertically fractured, it is better to advise to go for an extraction in single rooted tooth. If in case of multi rooted tooth, if one root is vertically fractured, we can do hemisection in order to save the same respective tooth by using the hemisection of the fractured root of the tooth. If the fracture of the root of the tooth is continuous or more damaging factor, more than the apical one third or two third, it is unfeasible to restore the tooth with the any other kind of uh, restorative materials. It is better to advise the patient to go for extraction. So, if the root of the tooth is asymptomatic after fracture of the tooth, we have to keep the patients in observation in order to avoid the formation of any kind of pulse, pain or anything else. If the patient is asymptomatic even over a period of time, definitely we can restore the tooth by using a post and core method. The post and core method is in order to restore the tooth, the health of the root of the tooth is very very important. If the root of the tooth is very healthy and asymptomatic, we can definitely use the different types of posts available in the market, either prefabricated or custom made post. But in case of prefabricated post, parallel sided or serrated posts are much more better advisable rather than the screwed post because screwed posts generate more amount of tensions rather than the parallel sided or serrated post and also we can use custom made post in order to increase the length of the root of the tooth so we can use the post and core method in order to restore the endodontically treated tooth again the depending upon the nature of the fracture of the tooth if the fracture of the tooth is not vertical other than the vertical fracture, definitely we can restore with a post and core method.